Uh, Darian, first off, uh, congratulations on, on the commitment. And, uh, you know, first off, just uh, what, what have the past couple of days been like for you? Just, uh, you know, a lot of interaction with the tweet, a lot of reaction. I'm sure you've gotten a lot of texts, a lot of calls, too. Just what have the past couple of days been like for you? The uh, past couple of days have been amazing. You know, just being able to talk to the coaches, I feel that a lot of animosity has has uh, went away from me, you know. But first, I want to just give under to God and then – for giving me the opportunity to choose another school. So it's been a great feeling and I'm happy. I'm happy with the decision I made. And so with, I think I did what's best for me. No doubt. And, uh, you know, my first exposure to you, um, it was actually a couple of years ago in the state finals uh, against Blyville. Uh, that was my first year covering high school sports. And my first interaction was like, oh, holy crap, this kid's good. Uh, so just wanted to get your thoughts first off on, uh, just your high school career as a whole. And then, uh, just kind of like a, a timeline of that, you know, kind of leading up to, to the Arkansas commitment, just kind of your, your biggest takeaways just from that period and how it, I guess, has kind of prepared you for right now. And high school was fun. You know, I had an amazing time in high school with my teammates. I feel that I developed my game strongly during high school. I feel that I did what I needed to do going into the next chapter of my life, which was college basketball. I feel that I've developed my game much more in college at Arkansas. And, you know, now I feel that I can just put all those tools together and just become a better version of myself, almost to the best of myself, hopefully. You know, so that's what I'm working towards. No doubt. And, and you mentioned that that time at Arkansas. Just what, what were some of the biggest things you learned, you know, during that first year there? And, uh, you know, you, you did see the court, uh, you know, I think 21 games played. But, you know, just talking about that season as a whole and what some of the biggest takeaways for you was. I feel some of the biggest takeaways for me was actually off of the court. You know, I, I feel that I was able to build bonds with my teammates. You know, I feel that I was more social with them than I ever had been before, you know, as far as basketball wise and off the court. So. I feel that I developed my game on and off the court. I feel that what I learned up there was being by myself. I was by myself a lot. You know, away from my parents, you had to grow up, grow up more than you ever had before in, in your time period of life. And so I feel that I, I just grew up and I'm able to become more responsible now. For sure. And then, you know, kind of getting to, uh, you know, the end of the season and, uh, you know, you announcing uh, that, that you're going to be entering the transfer portal, just, you know, kind of what led to that decision. And then just what was the biggest takeaway for you, like throughout your time in the portal and just, you know, that whole process of kind of reopening the recruitment? Well, you know, I thought there was just time for a change. I want I want to be in a better position. I want to put myself in a better position. You know, not saying that Arkansas wasn't the place, but I just felt that it was time for me to make a change. And I'm I'm happy I did. You know, once Arkansas State, I'm very excited to link up with Coach B and the rest of the coaching staff. So I feel that it's going to be a great, a great time for me there as well, and hopefully it'll be even better for me. So I'm excited. I'm excited. I'm excited to work and just get close to my dream. Absolutely. I know a lot of uh, Arkansas State fans are excited, too. And, you know, you mentioned just uh, Arkansas State as, as a whole, just th from that visit on, just what were what were the conversations like with, with Coach Hodson? And uh, what, what were some of your biggest, uh, I, I guess, takeaways, your, your first, uh, I guess, your first impression of Jonesboro and then uh, ultimately that decision to to choose Arkansas State? So actually, I used to play basketball, the AU tournaments up in Jonesboro sometime. So I was kind of familiar with the area. But I feel that I grow even more interested and become more familiar with it for the time period that I'm up there. And then just meeting the coaches that right when I got up there, you know, I go off vibes a lot and I got I got great vibes from them. You know, the coaching staff is amazing. And I just feel that they believe in me and that they can help me do what I'm trying to do. For sure. And I guess what was the biggest thing in terms of, uh, I guess, the pitch to, to come to, to Arkansas State? You know, you, you mentioned the relationship, you mentioned the vibes and, and you mentioned, um, you know, just I guess the overall team outlook too. just what, what stands out to you the most when you look at Arkansas State just from from an on the court perspective. From an on the court perspective, now that they have a new new coach staff, basically everything is new at Arkansas State as far as basketball with me. Everything is new and I'm just ready to try to turn the program around you know, with me and, me and the other guys. And I feel that we can do that with the right puzzle pieces. You know, we have a great coaching staff, coach that just came from winning the SEC championship, coaches that have been with him for long longer than I was born, I feel. So 
I feel that they have a great connection with each other. You know, I feel that we all just – we all will build off one another, you know. I feel that I build with my teammates. And, you know, if we have the right pieces and with the right pieces, I feel that we can compete with anybody on any level. And so I'm excited. And I just want to do my job and try to – try to – most of all, win a national—I mean, a national championship with them. But first, you know, you got to take a small step. That's Sun Belt, Sun Belt Conference Championship. So, I'm ready to try to turn the program around the best I can, and play to the best of my ability with the teammates around me. That's going to help me and push me to do that. And so, I'm very happy, and I feel that I can do that right there, at Arkansas State. Absolutely. And, uh, you know, just just a couple more questions, too. So, you know, looking at, uh, you know, the whole process with you in the portal, just uh, one, how many visits did you take? And two, uh, how many offers did you have? Because I, I can imagine as soon as your name entered the portal, I'm, I'm sure Arkansas State wasn't the only school. So I took so I took two visits. I took one to Vanderbilt and I took one to Arkansas State. I talked with Ole Miss. I talked with LSU. I talked with Sam Houston. I talk with a lot of schools, Richmond. I talk with a lot of schools. So I had, like, I'm not trying to say it in a way, but I had uh, options to go. But, you know, as far as Arkansas State, it just felt the right move for me. And like I said, I feel that that's a place that I can develop my game on and off the court, and I'm happy with it. And I feel that that's where I'll be my, my best self. So I'm happy with my decision, you know, and I'm ready to compete with anybody. For sure. And uh, so for, for folks that uh, may not know who Darian Ford is on the court, uh, how would you describe yourself both, I guess, as a as a basketball player, but also, you know, even off the court as well? I feel that I'm a very hard worker, you know, on and off the court and whatever I do, because that's what my dad has always taught me, you know, whatever I do, try to be the best at it and work the, work the hardest at it. So I know I know hard work. I, I can tell you that I know hard work and that's that's going to be my main thing. The main thing is trying to keep the main thing the main thing. And hard work for me is my main thing. And so, you know, on the court, developing my skill, trying to take care of my family, you know, and I feel that that's what I'm – that's my mindset going into these games and these practices, you know, just competing. You know, I love to compete. So whoever's – whoever we play against, I'm ready to compete against. You know, I'm not backing down from anybody, you know, because – I have a job and I have a purpose. All right, man. Well, I think that's uh, about all I got. Um, you know, is there anything else you wanted to add uh, just for, for you personally about, uh, you know, this whole experience of coming to Arkansas State or anything I might have forgotten to mention? No, I'm I'm just blessed. And I thank you for taking the time to talk with me. But like I said, I'm blessed and I'm happy that my family's happy as well. So, you know, just, just a great day. And I'm just ready to compete. I'm ready to compete and it's going to be fun.